I started the video because I'm sick and tired of waiting for you. <laughs> I'm cooking your dinner there, swing butt. <laughs> <laughs> What, honey? I'm sharing two easy, high-protein meals from Costco that I'm making this week for fast weight loss. And guess what I'm making? Chicken skewers with mini roasted potatoes and dill pickle salad on the side and Swiss jalapeno chicken burgers with veg and dip on the side. We're starting with the chicken skewers and the taties, honey, so this is what you're gonna need. <laughs> We need 880 grams of mini potatoes, and this is the big Costco bag, the Little Potato Company. I have these quartered, I rinse them, and they're sitting in cold water to get off any excess starch. We're gonna need a tablespoon of melted butter. This is unsalted because that's what we keep in the house. Half a teaspoon of salt and half a teaspoon of pepper for the side. This is our, one of our favorite salads from Costco. This is the creamy dill pickle and it comes with all the fixins like the croutons, feta, dill pickle seasoning, some fancy creamy dill dressing. We're gonna need some chicken skewers and these are the scope Lockies chicken souvlaki. We're gonna be using four of them because this meal is gonna make four servings or meals, two for me and two for Sassy, and we're gonna save the other four for another day, put them in the freezer. So I have the oven preheated at 425 degrees for the potatoes, and I've got two baking trays lined with tin foil and sprayed with cooking spray. What I want to do with the potatoes, they're going to take the longest, so I'm going to get those ready, but they'll be quick little cuties, let me tell you. I'm just going to take the potatoes out and dry them really well, and then um, toss them with our butter and seasoning. So I just like putting them in a dry tea towel and then just minking them around until they're really cute and dry. I'm gonna pour the butter in and just use the spatula to get it all out. Then the seasoning. And I'm gonna use my hands because I like getting down and dirty with it, but you can use a spoon if you like. I'm just gonna toss these up and Make sure they're coated really well with everything, really evenly. Oh yeah, look how sweet those are, my love. I'm gonna put half of them in a single layer on this cookie sheet. I could probably go one tray, but I don't wanna crowd them. I want them to get like crispy. So I'm gonna do two trays. There we go. Just like that. Oh, you can use a little more love on your tray, can't you? There we go. Okay, so I'm gonna put them in the oven for 20 to 30 minutes and I'm gonna flip the trays and the potatoes halfway through. Okay, I got the air fryer preheated to 400 degrees. I have sprayed these skewers with cooking spray and the air fryer pan thingy with cooking spray as well. And I'm going to cook these for 10 to 12 minutes and flip them halfway. Oh yeah, those look great. So they took 12 minutes at 400 and I did flip them halfway. Look how cute they look. Oh, these are looking so sweet and smelling yummy. All right, the potatoes are done. They were 30 minutes at 425. They are looking crispy and cute. One skewer is going to go on um, a plate because Sass and I are eating this for dinner tonight, so one for each of us there. And then the others are going in the meal prep containers and I'm just gonna take it off the skewer and put it in. And one is for me and one's for Sass for another day this week. Okay, now I'm gonna divide the potatoes into four. I'm gonna start with a half cup. I always like to do that and then I'll divide the rest up as we go. Okay, so we got a quarter cup now and I'm gonna divide the rest and that should work out perfect. That is perfect. Now we'll mix the salad. Okay, I'm gonna do the salad now. So this bag, I'm gonna split between Sassy and I for today. And then as you can see here, I have the other bag, which when we eat these, we'll eat that as well. 
So it comes with everything you need. I love this, this kit. So you get the little crouton, put them in. You get little crumblies, look at this. Isn't that cute? And oh yeah, <laughs> the first time we made this, we forgot the dill seasoning. Don't forget the dill seasoning. The best part. Yes, and remember when we forgot it? I think on camera too. <laughs> All right, this smells amazing. I have lost 130 pounds and kept it off for nine years. And this is what I learned about myself in that time. I love food, but I don't really love cooking and long complicated meal preps. So I need things that are quick, easy, and tasty, like these meals that I'm making here. I also have a really big appetite and it's normal to be hungry when you're eating in a calorie deficit to lose weight. So I need my meals to be full of protein because protein helps lower your hunger hormone ghrelin so you can feel fuller longer. And I'm not sponsored by Costco, but we love shopping there because they have a lot of tasty, low-cal, high-protein options that are really quick. And it, you can buy it in bulk so you can make multiple meals and be good for the week. So now that I've got this measured out here, or now that I got this clinkered, I'm going to do a measurement. I'm going to split, do one cup first, like so. And then looks like we'll get two cups. So there's that one. And then there is two cups each. There we go. All right, so this is mine. This one is sassy. I changed shirts for thumbnail action because I needed a cute shirt that wasn't busy. <laughs> um, so this entire meal, the friends, is 550 cals, 24 grams of fat, 54 grams of carbs, and 31 grams of protein. So the friends, I lost my weight with portion control. If you wanna know the exact meals and portions that I ate to lose the weight, you can buy my weight loss ebook called The First 50. The link is down below, and code Nicole will save you 10%. And speaking of protein, if you're looking for a good one, this is the best tasting protein powder ever. It's HTLT Sups, and this one is the Fruity Cereal. I love adding this one to my protein ice cream, and if you want to know how I make it, I have a short on my YouTube channel called I Eat This Every Day Instead of Ice Cream, and that's how I make it. So go look that up. Buy this. It is so good. You have to try it. Code Nicole will save you 15% off, and the link is down below. Here we go. Give it a little taste to Rooney. Who knew that salt and butter and pepper taste is so good? Let's try this chicken. Oh, You're yeah, right. Mm. Mm. I love that little lemon kick that the mm -hmm. chicken has. Mm -hmm. Oh, it is so good. Kyle and I love like Greek stuff and this really tastes um, yummy and greeky. Oh, and this sounds so good. If you guys never had it before, you gotta try it. You gotta be a pickle, be a pickle fan though, because it's very pickly. But if you are, okay, we're eating this, and I will see you in a flash of editing for the Swiss jalapeno chicken burgers with veggie dip cutie. <laughs> what are you doing there, Big Mom? I started the video because I'm sick and tired of waiting for you. <laughs> Slinkbot. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, <laughs> we're gonna make Swiss burgers. Jalapeno Swiss chicken burgers. Guys, are you kidding? You can lose weight eating this, you don't have to give up burgers? Yeah, and I'm gonna show you how, buddy, so let's do it. This is what you're gonna need, okay? Look at this. We're gonna need, so we're gonna be making four servings with this again. So we need four chicken burgers. This, you get, look at 16 really decent sized burgers from Costco. These are just the plain chicken home style burgers. And I gotta show you this, the cows. 200 cows for the size, which is incredible. And look at the protein, 28 grams. Oh, and they, they are thick. 
And if you can't find exactly, just look around at your Costco and find something similar. Look at that. Okay, we're also gonna need, we're gonna be adding flavor and protein because Swiss cheese does that. I love Swiss cheese. We got the Saputo Light from Costco. Oh, let, let Sassy do his joke. No, no, I, I can't see it. Oh, <laughs> I thought you were gonna do your light joke. You know, you like, did it for me. you know, you, it's not that heavy. Is that how you do it? Let's see the front again, because I couldn't see it. So we need four slices of Swiss cheese, and this is the Saputo Light. I love Swiss cheese because it adds flavor with not a ton of cows, and there's eight grams of protein per slice. Per slice? Yeah, isn't that crazy? Like, that's why we've been using Swiss cheese our whole weight loss journey, because flavor, low cal, if you get the light, and great protein. We also need some buns, and these are the La Forne Dore Brioche buns, and I really like the cows for this. Look at 160 cows. And because it's brioche, there's actually some decent protein in there, Whoa. five grams. And so you get a pack of like three, four packs at Costco. We're gonna be using Perfect. four. And then you guys know we need some veg here. The, you guys know about the Freddy Fingers. We always show you those in our, we get that from Costco in our grocery haul. So we need two cups divided into half a cup per serving of cucumber spears. So we got that ready to go. We also need 12 ounces of carrots divided into three ounces each. And these are the baby carrots. We get like the ones from Costco and then we put them in water so that they sit. They last us like a couple of weeks because you get so many of them and we just pull from them through the week. We need some dip, and this is the Skodadakis jalapeno. We love the tzatziki, the Skodadakis from Costco. We've never tried this jalapeno, so we're really excited. It's really good cows. Two, it's two tablespoons for 50 cows, and um, yeah, I'm very excited to try this. So we're gonna be using one and a half tablespoons for, uh, for the veggies, and then we're gonna put a tablespoon of this on the bun to make a jalapeno Swiss chicken burger. So I've got the air fryer preheated to 400 degrees, and I'm, I've got these sprayed with cooking spray. I also have the air fryer sprayed. We're gonna do, I'm gonna try to shove four uh, of these burgers in here. Ah, good enough, bud. And uh, we're gonna do eight, 18 minutes, so I'm gonna flip them halfway and uh, see. Ready, wait, you can fit right. Yeah, we did it, four. <laughs> While the burgers are cooking, I'm gonna divide up the veg and the dip. So for today, since Sass and I are eating this for dinner, I'm gonna put the veggies on the plates and then I'll show you the containers I'm using for the next day. Go. I'm gonna use these Tupperware containers for the other veggies to store so that they're ready to go. There, so that's for Sass and I for another day. And I'll just cover the map. And then I have the other buns for the other two. We're gonna eat these tomorrow. So that's ready to go. And then what I'm gonna do is put some dip for the veggies. So we're gonna do one and a half tablespoons for a serving. Oh wow, Whoa. that looks great. Mmm, that smells good. Okay, we'll stir it. Wow, that looks really good. Okay, so let's start with a tablespoon. And then we're gonna go with the half tablespoon. So one and a half for each. One and a half for each. So that'll be ready to go. And then I'm gonna put some on the buns to flavor the buns with the jalapeno sweets. So I'm gonna do the top of the bun and I'm gonna take a tablespoon and put it on there and then spread that out real beautiful so that it's ready to go. So these ones we'll put for the, uh, tomorrow's meal over to the side and then 
These ones are for tonight. All right, the friends, 400 degrees for 18 minutes. Flip them halfway. And I'm going to place the Swiss cheese on them now so that it starts to melt. And now we're gonna put a beautiful one on top and put your sweet little bun like this. There we go, we got four meals out of this. One for Sassy and I for tomorrow, one for Sassy and I for tonight. And this entire meal, veg and the dip and the bun and all the glomusas, we're looking at 546 cows, 21 grams of fat, 41 grams of carbs, and ready for the protein? Drum roll please, 46 grams of protein. 46? 46, Whoa. because enter the Swiss cheese, enter the chicken burger, and add a little bit of protein from the brioche. Whoa! So when I was new to calorie counting, just to give an example, uh, Big Mac with the tiny little meat on it is 500 and something calories, just the so, Big Mac. look at this. So the volume of this, with the size of that chicken burger, you're getting cheese, you're getting veggies and dip to keep you full longer, the protein. And that is exactly what this is all about. This is why we've been able to keep our weight off and get it off in the first place. Tasty, quick and easy, lots of protein, and low-cal, high volume. You want to choose meals that really keep you full, like these two meals that we showed in this vid. Tasty, makes you look and feel like you're getting a lot of food, but still really decent calories, lots of protein to keep you full. You don't have to have boring or gross food to lose weight. We learned weight loss should never be a punishment. You have to love what you're eating, what you're doing. You've got to be excited. You've got to dance around and be like, well, I'm eating burgers to lose weight. Yeah. And for us, we want it ready very quickly, as quick as possible. Yes, yes because like we said already, we don't like cooking, but we love food. So it's got to be quick and easy. The friends, Watch this vid this vid for more fun, sustainable weight loss tips because Sass and I are real friends losing weight in the real world. And we love it. That's why we're always doing it. And thanks so much for watching. And I will catch you in the next vid. Cue it in. And guess what? I'm going to serenade you with something very lovely. I always love making up songs. And this is one of the ones that I sang to Sassy when we were first dating. You're going to remember this. It's an OG, Sass. Are you ready? And stir the soup and stir the soup and make it for your breakfast. And eat the soup and eat the soup and eat it for your breakfast. You're welcome. Thanks. I've got it. I should have an album. What do you get when you have a great CD? An Oscar. Yeah. A Grammy. A Grammy? Yeah. Yeah, I won that. You won the Oscar for great CDs. Go for making soup and eat for breakfast. Love ya. <laughs> See ya. Bye. It's gone off the rails now. They like it. <laughs> Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Bite through it. You can